Alright, I'm going to show you guys how to do a quick color correction in Photoshop. Here I have a picture of me taken underwater uh, with my GoPro. Uh, this was the original picture and then this is what I what it looks like after color correction. So this is afterwards and this is before. You can tell that there's a huge difference. Especially in like the blues and clarity, blue and green. So I'm going to first change the color balance and because water absorbs a lot of red light I'm going to add red light back into the picture. And I'm also going to change, um, I'm going to mess with the magenta and green slider. And what I do here, I'm just trying to change the color levels so it looks like more natural light. What I use uh, when I'm judging this, I tend to use my skin color uh, because it's fairly easy to recognize that underwater, as well as like uh, swim shoots, swimsuit, or sometimes. Um, paddles are just colors that aren't usually underwater. And then after I've added the color balance, I'm going to go to hue, no, brightness and contrast. Um, in a lot of darker pictures, I tend to increase the brightness because it's really dark. In this picture, um, there's a lot of rocks, about half the picture, and so increasing the brightness just overall increases uh, you, the ability for you to see more detail and then also increasing the contrast also allows more detail to be seen and then after that I go to hue and saturation here I just change the saturation increase it just a little bit because if you change it too much it makes the colors look unnatural and that's just three quick easy steps I use in Photoshop so this is it after color correction and then here's it before and then comparing it to one I did a while ago that one I'm not sure what I did I forgot but I think I added more stuff yeah oh okay so I remembered um, one last adjustment that I probably made to my other color corrected picture the final one this one to, that makes it a little bit more realistic I guess is a way of putting it. So this is the one that I was just working on and the adjustment that I'm going to add, one last adjustment is photo filter and on this you can either pick one of these three warming filters uh, they look fairly similar or you can just uh, select this color selection, this orange color um, so I just leave that as the default and then you, incre then you can increase the density to however much you want. I think that this makes the picture look a lot more um, color wise color wise more realistic because it's a little bit less blue I guess is, is a way of putting it. So this is what I had before why I just left off and then with it it looks a lot more like the original. There's a slight difference um, probably it's between or there's a slight difference between the one I just made and the one I did before um, I think this is probably because of a culmination of just the different values in these four different um, layers that I was working on. Um, right now, I th actually like the one that I just made a little bit better than the one I had before. So this is what I had before that I did a couple weeks ago, and then this is the one I just made. So yeah, that's how you do color corrections for underwater pictures using Photoshop.